When placing various objects on slides in a presentation, it's important that the objects align correctly, and especially that they don't jump around in location from slide to slide. An underutilized feature of PowerPoint 2010 is what's called placeholders, and in later versions of PowerPoint, placeholders become part of what are called layouts. If we look at the current presentation, we'll run it from the current slide and we notice that on slide 2 the image is located in a particular location we click again the image moves the image again is in another location and it's a bit disconcerting to have things that move around all over the slides and also you may want to actually use two images or two bits of content on a particular slide so if we go to slide 2 in this presentation, a right click on the slide background, layout, select a title and content. Now I'm going to use the tab key to select the picture. Control X is the keyboard shortcut to cut the picture and place it in memory. Select the placeholder, Control V to paste. And the picture now sits exactly within that placeholder. The placeholder changes its edge size to match the picture. So if we move down to the second slide, do the same thing again, tab, control X to select the picture, control V, again the third slide, tab to select the picture, control V. We notice now that our pictures are all in exactly the same location. Where we have two images, we're going to take advantage of a double content layout. So if we move to two content, select the layout, hit the tab key to select the picture, control X to cut, select the layout and paste, again tab, control X, select the placeholder either by with the mouse or with the tab key, control V and now our pictures are perfectly aligned. When we run that presentation we find that it's much better. We go to slide 1, slide 2, slide 3, slide 4 and slide 5. Those images match perfectly. Again a very underutilized feature of PowerPoint.